Alright, good morning guys. It is Monday morning. Back to the drawing board. Um, just wanted to drop some positivity with you guys. Um, I know I really didn't post any of my, of course my Christian life as yet. You know I talk about that all the time. But, you know, just for you guys just to stay positive, be you. Okay? In a world full of, full of squid words, be a Spongebob and a Patrick. And I know a lot of people be like, like, what is she talking about? But no matter what, in a world full of when everybody's conforming to whatever someone else is doing, a world full of everybody copying each other, everybody just trying to follow the, the social norm, you know, trying to be popular, trying to be someone other than themselves. Be yourself. Be yourself. No one can't beat you at being you. No one can judge you like you do. So, you know, at the end of the day, be yourself. You don't want to go home and be like, dang, I wish I was being myself I was able to say what I wanted to say like live in your live in your realness live in you okay live in God okay I always tell people like once I found God I found beauty I found a reason to live I found purpose and a lot of people say you know I don't have a gift you know I don't do all these things like paint draw whatever or sing but you have a gift that's one thing it even says in the Bible that God gives you a gift and he gives you the gift of faith and also this this purpose like you just gotta search you guys gotta read i know it's hard with all these things going on like sometimes you think that like lord i'm put on this world with so much problems and so much tribulations like how am i supposed to be great how am i supposed to be like someone who you want me to be someone who i can feel like i can look up to you and i won't be judged by others you just gotta seek him you just you just gotta reach more for him I always find people like looking in the car, right? but you always gotta like you gotta you gotta create a desire. You always pray. That's why I always pray for a desire for God, for me to seek Him more, for me to see His face, for me to like stop everything that I'm doing and do more of Him. I know, guys, I'm driving on I-95, but you know, this time this I'm not holding the phone, but I definitely want to drop. I probably might do this every day. Just some some morning, you know words some morning words you know even prayer you know what i'm saying because god is good okay god is so good just wake up every day and just be like god is so good and also just pray that every day will be a good day and pray that you will learn from your faults and you will just be better you should always try to be better than yesterday you know what i'm saying i'm heading to school guys you know i always start off with a prayer saying like oh god thank you jesus for you know like me being able to wake up because I've been waking up late every for the past few weeks coming to class which that's not good well not really for class but for like tutoring and stuff like that but I thank God for that like, I was able to wake up early to, you know and I'm on my way gonna reach there early for the tutoring and stuff like that like God is so good okay and I just want to leave a little prayer with you guys that's okay um I can cut it off if I pray too long because sometimes that happens Sometimes that happens. Sometimes you get lost in the prayer. You, get, you know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. As long as you communicate. And communication is the key. In every relationship, communication is the key. Okay? And communication with God is the key. Relationship with God is the key. Because a lot of people be like, oh gosh, I, I hate churches because like what they did to me. And then like I can't. Like, you know, some people just can't relate to a church. And I don't blame people if they don't feel comfortable in going to churches or they afraid to feel judged but do this for me have a relationship with god like that is just so important because as long as you know your relationship with god you're good you're you're good okay like 
like I'm telling you, you feel so much better. People will say something to you. Yes, there are times that you're gonna feel hurt. Yes, there are times that you're gonna be like, God, I don't know if I can do this. But still, you know that you go to him, you speak to him, and he will speak positive words to you. I know a lot of people say that you can't hear the voice of God, but if you just wait, that voice, he always uses a familiar voice. So it might sound like yourself, but it's really God speaking to you. Because if you think about it, why when I'm going through all this hard times, I'm trying not to get emotional. <laughs> why when I'm going through all these hard times, like I'm now all of a sudden I'm speaking positive about things. You know what I'm saying? So that's God. That's God speaking through, through you to you. That's how amazing he is. That's how cool he is. But yeah, I'm going to leave you guys with a prayer. Um, I'm not going to close my eyes because obviously I'm driving. But if you can close your eyes if you want. Oh God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for waking us up this morning, oh God. Thank you for your love, your grace, and your mercy that has kept us, oh God. Ask you, Lord Jesus, to forgive us of all our sins, oh God, known and unknown, oh God. Ask you, Lord Jesus, that you guide and protect our path, oh Lord Jesus, that you direct our path, oh God. Ask you, Lord Jesus, that you give us a clear direction, oh God. Ask you, Lord Jesus, that we be able to see our purpose in this world, oh God, and that we will seize the day, oh God. Ask you, Lord Jesus, that you will have your way with us right now in the name of Jesus. Ask you, Father God, that your rod and your staff, that it will comfort us, oh God, that it will guide us, that it will, oh lead us where we need to be oh god ask you lord jesus that you send your guiding angels to camp around us right now in the name of jesus ask you father god to cover us all with your blood oh god ask you lord for your protection ask you lord jesus for your healing ask you lord jesus for your deliverance ask you lord jesus for victory oh father god ask you lord jesus for favor oh god in the name of jesus ask you lord jesus for your grace and your mercy oh god to keep us to protect us oh god ask you lord jesus touch us at school oh lord jesus touch us at work oh god ask you lord jesus that you move in us oh God, I ask you, Lord Jesus, that your light shine through us, Lord Jesus. That when people see us, oh God, they see you in us, oh Lord Jesus. Oh Father God, I ask you, Lord Jesus, that to touch our hearts and our mind, oh God. Let us not worry what the world thinks about us or what people think about us, but what you think about us, oh Lord Jesus. And oh Father God, I ask you, Lord, to correct us, oh God. I ask you, Lord Jesus, to protect us, oh God. Oh Lord Jesus, I put everything before your feet, oh God. I claim straight A's in all our classes right now in the name of Jesus. I claim scholarships, oh God. Oh Father God, I just claim favor, Lord Jesus. I claim, oh God, that we get promotions at our jobs. Oh God, I claim a better job, oh God. I just claim that you just have your way with each and every person, oh God. Ask you, Lord Jesus, to touch your churches, oh God. Oh God, that they do of you, Lord Jesus. Ask you, Father God, that they follow you, Lord Jesus. That it's not just a business, oh God. That it's not just something just to raise money or become famous, oh God. But they're doing it to win souls. They're doing it to serve your people, oh Lord Jesus. Oh God, please make us be more like you, more like Christ right now in the name of Jesus. Oh God, you are great. Oh God, you are mighty. Oh God, you are wonderful. Oh God, if I just say it, oh Lord, today or yesterday, oh God, I want you to know, Lord Jesus, that I thank you, oh God, for all you have done, oh God. Thank you for the shoes on my feet, the clothes on my back, oh God. Father God, thank you for the shelter over our heads, Lord Jesus. I thank you, Lord Jesus, for the favor, oh God, that continues to keep on falling, oh God. Our oh Lord Jesus, have your way with all of us right now, oh God. Mold your people, God. Touch us all, Lord Jesus. The ones who are sad, the ones who have anxiety, the ones who have depression, oh God. I rebuke fear and I rebuke anxiety. I rebuke depression. I rebuke negativity. Anything that's not of you, oh God, I rebuke it right now in the name of Jesus. And I claim victory over our lives right now in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we shall prevail, oh God, because we serve a God who is great and mighty, who is positive, oh God. Oh God, please change our talks, oh God. Make us be more positive, oh God. Oh Lord Jesus, even when things are not looking right, Lord Jesus, ask Lord Jesus for victory, even in our situations right now in the name of Jesus. Touch us at this very moment. Everyone who is watching this video, oh God, touch me personally, Lord Jesus, that, oh Lord, even though I'm doing this YouTube thing, that I grow in you, oh God, and I will not stray from you, Lord Jesus. Oh God, God, please make your word touch people, oh Lord Jesus, who even know of you, oh God, and who know of you and who is struggling, oh God, and needs someone to speak a word into their lives, oh God. Ask Lord Jesus to have your way right now in the name of Jesus. God, we love you, we thank you, oh God, and I put it all before your feet, Lord Jesus. Father God, anything I failed to ask you, forgot to ask you, oh God, fail not, forget not to grant unto us, oh Lord Jesus. Ask you, Lord Jesus, oh Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus, because this is a way for me to speak to you more also, oh God. And ask Lord Jesus, that is, let this be a way for others to even pray as I pray, oh God, and that they will worship you more, oh God, and seek you more right now in the name of Jesus. 
our beat that has a Satan right now, oh God. And ask you, Lord Jesus, that's to have your way with all of us right now in the name of Jesus. Father God, like I said, Lord Jesus, we love you. We thank you, oh God, and we put it all before your feet. In your mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 All right, guys. Live a positive day. The prayer has went up. Claim victory over everyone's life, actually. Oh, I'm still praying. <laughs> but just, just seek him. And if, if you don't even know how to pray, prayer is literally communication. Prayer is just communication with God. You're talking to him about your day. Even though he knows your day, you're, talk, you're expressing it more to him. And how you want something different in your life or how you want things to change. He just want to hear you. He want the communication. God knows what you want. He know, He see your wants. He see your needs. He provides your needs. He know what it is that you're praying for. He know what it, it is that you want, but he wants you to speak to him. You know what I'm saying? People be like, well, God already know what I'm going through, so why don't he just do? No, it's not that easy because if it was that easy, we all would be in heaven. We will all have, you know, that's why we have tests and trials. I probably, that's another video I would do, but we all have tests and trials. And if we didn't have, go through some stuff, we would have been right into heaven. If we all were perfect people, we would have been right in heaven. But God wanted us to go through some stuff to show our, to trying to, what's that word? To strengthen us, to basically build our faith. He wants us to build our faith. So guys, just live in your truth. Keep God first. Remember, stay positive. No matter what, stay positive, okay? And just have a blessed day. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Really. Just let the Lord lead you. At this point, I'm sorry, guys. I'm still in prayer mode. I'm about to continue worship. Yeah, take time for God, okay? Make sure wherever you're going, I'll make sure every morning I put on music so I can just pray. I can sing. I can listen to his word. Because sometimes you need it. Before you even walk into a building, you just got to be like, God, just, just lead me. Just guide me. Oh, God, touch every person in the room, oh, Lord Jesus. Surround, surround me around people that won't create negativity. Surround me around positive people. Touch my friends. Oh God, surround me around positive people. Correct their talks, oh God. You know, you just gotta speak to God like that. Oh God, I'm sending that to the prayers to Jesus. But you got you just gotta have a communication with him. Okay, have a blessed day. I hope to do this tomorrow. I will upload this video hopefully. I'm not gonna say during class because I sound like a bad student, but you know. Probably in between classes because it's just a prayer. But have a blessed day, you guys.